Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm about to show you how you can fix Dota 2 not opening. Okay, so I'll share with you what I've tried myself when I've tested. I can't guarantee this will work, but I'll just, uh, yeah, share with you what worked for me. So make sure you leave your feedback down below, your results. I truly want to uh, see this problem not happening anymore because it's very annoying and it's very frustrating when you just want to play the game. So let's jump right now in, the, in this tutorial. And so what you have to do to fix the game not opening, usually this is related to um, you not having the latest updates, the latest drivers. I can guarantee usually this is the problem. Not 100%, but usually this is the problem, okay, guys? I've tried, I've tested, I love fixing stuff, I love fixing problems, and usually that's the issue. Sometimes can also, this problem can relate or, you know, have some uh, motives not to work, and part of that reason is because just uh, the game or the there's a program that is interfering with your uh with your game so make sure you also deactivate some your antivirus something like that you know all the programs make sure you don't have any programs that are running in the background and can potentially can interfere with the game and cause it to crash now you can go to windows update here click on advanced options and here in advanced options if you click on optional updates and expand driver updates make sure you check all of this and then click on download and install okay click on download and install and this uh, usually should be should have a huge list here so this can potentially fix the problem because you might have some important uh, drivers in that list but if that didn't work you still have this problem go in the list in the description of this video and leave there some links and there you should see all the links here. First link, go to DirectX and user runtime web installer and here make sure you click on download, okay? This is very important, this is what you need to run any important, any game pretty much. And it's just uh, something really uh, a important tool pretty much. So make sure you click on the download button. And once you install DirectX, head over to Microsoft Visual C++. This, uh, this website and here make sure you click on this link, install this as well and you still have the but actually just make sure you're doing that and the end of the video restart your computer because that's what you have to do you won't see any results right now so make sure you start your computer once you start all all the step steps okay so now in uh, if you're in you have a nvidia car graphic car make sure you click on doll on here and you can all this is what you will see this is your first experience that's pretty much what you install and if you click on drivers and here in drivers um, here in drivers, make sure you click on check for updates and then click on download. All right, this is very important. It's really important to keep your computer up to date. And also for AMD user, make sure you click on download. This will auto detect drivers and install for you and for Intel as well. You can also go to device manager. Go to device manager and displace the adapters and click. Make sure you click on the update driver and search automatically for object for drivers or you can update and then click on browse and here you should see any potentially important drivers you can try and install, all right? That's uh, important as well. But now, another thing that you can do to fix up not opening Dota uh, 2 is to make sure you uh, have the latest updates, okay? And what I mean by that is sometimes in Windows, Windows uh, 11 there's some important updates so make sure you update your computer now there's some uh, like, you uh, like there's some times when I have that in my computer but that didn't work at all actually they really fixed um, made it worse so yeah sometimes there are some updates that are not very good but usually it's good to update your computer update windows and that's pretty much it guys please leave your feedback down below and also if you still have this problem leave your results in the comment section maybe i can help you in discord or you know i can guide you there in the comment section because i really understand the feeling when the game is not working you just want to play the game and it's simply not working so anyhow guys thank you for watching this video and i'll see you now on the next tutorial take care